Good morning, Pigholic friends. This is a tree, one of, we have two of them actually, um, two trees that have grown very well for us. And it's just mostly in a growing mode there, but it's got fruit on it and some have fallen to the ground already. Um, the only bright fig I found was up above my reach. So I used my ladder. My friend Brian down in Fresno told me to be very careful on ladders. And I only stepped two feet high to pick a fig. This is a six foot orchard ladder. It's a very stable three-legged ladder. I suggest you not use four-legged ladders out on soil that's uneven. Uh, these, you know, always make all, contact on all three legs, so it, they're very stable and they're a wider base on the portion you stand on. Anyway, so I picked this fig. Not that it got scarred some from rubbing, and it's not fully ripe either. But, you know, there's a lot of large fruit on here. You know, this one over here I just saw, it's actually riper. I just saw this. So this one doesn't have that scarring. Let me set the other one down on the ladder so this so a medium sized eye um, large big I'd say about 90 grams I'd guess very sweet it has a moderate to intense berry flavor and a little bit of acidity very jammy juicy fig um very nice um i'm not going to even bother eating this one is an excellent fig so look forward to this um, i believe it's supposed to be a common fig um, it's from italian origin again fico palazzo thanks for watching